we're about to find out here. Uh, we are about to find uh, out, this, that's for sure. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, the side of Ethereal to kind of like combat this. It looks like they are set up. We do have kind of a 2v3 here while Uranus is up at the top. I'm not sure I like it, but Kush able to pick that up quite quickly and is trapping at ZXC down. And a Ooh. guiding light takes him down. Zia's favorite second goes down quickly. Bruce Wayne on the chase here for Tamal. I don't think he's going to be able to get it. And he does clean it up just a little bit and now trying to make his escape. <laughs> no matter what is going on. Ziggy is basically in their base right now. <laughs> stopping the waves it's just and and you know what and that and that's a smart thing to do by bruce wayne is to be able to and we do have a kill now taking down zia's favorites uh is japanese here so there looks like they're gonna be putting some pressure onto wan wan trying to make their escape it is a 3v1 up there and they do take down chef at the top there and man it is all the way to safety i think uh, maybe a little bit of underestimation that we were talking about earlier for ethereal yeah, and they, they brought that goalie back in the chase. Now it's only a, a, about a 1.5 2K goalie now. And it looks like they're going to go in on them again. Uh, Kush might actually want to disengage as he doesn't really have the numbers. Right. And uh, uh, Xavier Avery to take down ZXC and Zia's favorite. And still, even though they didn't have the numbers, coming in with the position oh, to that disengage. Throw. Bruce Wayne taken down, not able to get far enough into the safety of his Esmeralda actually putting on some pretty decent damage. We have a fight going on up at top. Looks like Kush uh, actually might be a little bit of trouble here. Zia's favorite, and it all comes out by Wan Wan onto Kush. Kush goes down. Mamil is trying to get away. Chef not actually able to put any more damage on but he does get one for that and then a real world manipulation comes out ejector but like the the, the communication between the team the ejector comes out and then a guiding light immediately to, to help seal and a the snipe deal. and that a snipe was, by yeah. beatrix yeah, all at the same time it literally yeah and unfortunately it's just they are just one they are just too well yeah, you got light taunting. They're playing around. They know that they have. You can see the confidence oozing off of them right now. And uh, I hope that doesn't hurt. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> That, that guiding wow. light by Xavier. It is just, this is how Xavier is supposed to be played. And we do have Kush pushing back Zia's favorite, <laughs> and he might be in trouble here. Taken down so quickly. Seasons champions. These guys are not going to let up. Any type of mistakes that you have, Bruce Wayne comes in onto Ziggy, and he does make oh an escape. God, he might not have it. No, guiding no, light no, takes no. him out. Chef and Ash Cutie are going to disengage here, but I don't think they're going to be able to get this tower just yet. That guiding light is proven to be such a problem for Ethereum. and I don't think they understand. It's it's one thing, it's it's PTSD that you start getting from these Xavier, uh, from these Xavier yeah. It looks oh like Zia's favorite does get knocked okay. back, ejected back. ZXC actually able to get out of the way, and there is just nothing that they can do. Kush <laughs> brings him against the wall. Belmont taken down now, and oh! the Japanese is 13 and one, 14, nope, 13 and one, <laughs> still right now. <laughs> didn't want to let his teammates die alone yeah there we go and there oh is just God. nothing that ethereal is going to be able to do to stop the 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 wow. ravaging yeah, <laughs> that new wave just put out to them is it too late to take back what i said <laughs> this, <laughs> this was no that was i mean but it, it proves the show like you said this is who they are like they got to where they are right now for this right here their communication possibly pull out here uh and see what their decisions are what that they, what they're gonna have to do to play he gets in the way of that hook which is basically what you want to do against the franco if you're not gonna be able to stop him from getting into there you just need to get in the way and stop him from being able to push it and you see that kush does pick up this uh lithal wanderer is his favorite gets out of the way but oh. it's hooked and is gonna be taken oh, down here by uh mamil just oh. You have to be careful away, and you do see that ZXC is trying to take that minion up top there, and the uh, same thing happening up at top while uh, Kush is taking their jungle as well. And I do believe uh, Bruce Wayne might actually be in a little bit of trouble here as he's getting yes. up uh, behind by Kush, trying to get away. Does he have enough damage? He's going to try to take out Ziggy. Oh. Ziggy goes down, but he pays for that with his life, does Bruce Wayne, and this opens up, you know? Yeah, and it does look like uh, they are trading blue buffs right now. I do see that Japan Japanese is trying to offset this blue buff that uh, is being taken by uh, ZXC. Uh, looks like he was still able to get it, but he is in trouble here, taken down very quickly by four members of New Wave. They are just so...
uh, does get slowed down here. Mamil putting on some damage. It, it even oh. flies by shining oh. light. Nice. Finishes the job. And Kush, Zia's favorite, actually might be in trouble. Misses oh, the ult. Yeah. Do, he's trying to get away. Uh, get but out. this tower at the bottom is going to go down. But you do see that ZXZ is trying to do his best to take advantage of the fact that there is so and capitalize on it. That's what I'm curious about. You see Bruce Wayne trying to engage. A black Dragon form activated, and we, he is going in on the Kush with a spinning mode. Uh, oh and we do have there a, we go. a goal from there Atlas. Go. Oh, he comes Franco. out, takes down Franco. Chef, a lot of damage here. We do have a one-for-one -one trade, but we have ZXC not able to get away at... They're making, making light work of uh, ET Ethereal right now. Yeah, and it's just very unfortunate. Ask Cutie does go down to Xavier. Tamal able to flicker out oh. of that. ZXC actually might be in a little bit of trouble, but I'm not sure what they have left Ethereal to go ahead and stop this push into mid. Oh, a lot ZXC of damage coming down. down to ZXC. Taken down here with the Ziggy, Mamil, and Tamal here. And I'm not sure this is a fight that they want. Right now, I feel like they are uh, kind of, they are, they are far behind right now. It's about a five, uh, almost 6K gold lead right now. And we do see ZXC had a lot of damage coming down onto him. Ziggy just punching her way through this. <laughs> and there's just really not much that Ethereal can do. Oh, a nice ult comes out there. Real world manipulation comes down. Tamal looking for the hook. He does go down though, but it, Ziggy is able to take down ZXC. So we you don't know who's setting who. It just, I, I, I personally feel like there might not be enough damage from Ethereal right now. Uh, and well, it might be one of the hardest. Damage. No, look. Oh my god, just the oh, solo. ZXC. Oh, ZXC is able to get out. <laughs> Barely makes it out. <laughs> To kind of keep that in mind while you're pushing into base and if you want them to make a mistake most likely that is where you're going to see it and kush does get eyes on the zxc trying to ult away oh. gets immobilized and lethal counter finishes the job and it looks like there's not really going to be much that can stop them from taking this lord and i'm not even sure that maybe ethereal has enough to even stop this lord push yeah, they're getting held back right now, just sitting lane by themselves. They were able to go back and go back and engage on a whole team. Yeah, it, uh, uh, Guiding Light comes out to uh, drop Zia low enough for the rest of uh, Mamiel to be able to... Oh my god, a lot of damage there. Japanese actually Japa. might be in trouble here. <laughs> does get out of the way in time and we do still have a push happening here at the mid tower without or at the mid lane without that tower oh there's a lot god. of damage coming down are they gonna be able to stop chef takes a lot of damage does have to regroup kush getting out of the way here and this bottom tower goes down and the top tower goes down there is nothing left to protect the score and i'm not sure that they have enough of them they might actually regroup here whomming <laughs> so be ready because they just went ahead and charged in there ziggy walks into a bush here does she have enough to be able to stave off this attack it looks like she does Ooh. Uh, a lot of damage coming out. Guiding Light gets hooked, and down goes Zia's favorites uh, very quickly. Unfortunately, Zia uh, just having a lot of trouble uh, trying to 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 get uh, uh, with this this tanking of the the uh, Atlas here, and just been getting he's been getting uh, uh, taken down pretty quite early in all of these fights. And then we do have them going down into the engagement here. This is going to be enough. It looks like this is all she wrote for Ethereal. Black Dragon comes out, is trying to stave it off, but Ziggy here putting the final touches onto the tower. And that is a wrap, unfortunately, 2-0 for New Wave. Wow. Oh, my goodness. Those that games was... were fast. They and were it, fast. It's, it seemed like New Wave was just control. Both of them.